Hi, my name is Craig Steenstra, EdTech Consultant at Ken ISD, and I'm here to welcome you to Digital Literacy for Educators. Really what this course is all about is building your technological skills and knowledge and abilities so that you can function in a digital, uh, digitally enhanced educational environment. So if you look at these digital age literacies, we still have basic literacy. Yep, it's important to read, write, and do math. Uh, but in addition to that, we have these technological information literacies um, that are really essential for our students to know um, in order to be effective in our society. And in order to help them build their skill, we as educators need to increase our skill and knowledge so that we can be effective and efficient in our work. Not only does it pertain to helping students grow, but in our day-to-day -day work, um, these technology tools can help us be more efficient. Now, some people think, I'm just not techie, there's fear and anxiety, or maybe some people think, well, I'm pretty good, but I could be better. You could always be better. Whatever the case, wherever you are, I hope that this course can help you grow and to expand and to make progress and overcome whatever it is, the, whatever the barriers are to your um, work. So the objectives here, simply put, one, improve your skill and knowledge in operating systems and file management, help you to be more organized. Um, increase your skill with web browser use. Improve your use of shortcuts and search, and improve your use of multimedia. So those are your outcomes. Here's getting to it, and I'll be here to support you along the way. When you first get into the course in Edify, this is the screen that you will see. If you're watching this video, you've already seen to click this view lesson. Um, but if you haven't yet, I want you to take the pretest. If you click that and follow the prompts, it will basically be asking you to rate yourself on the different objectives in this course and give some reasoning to back it up. So it's going to set the benchmark um, for which will measure your growth uh, at the end. So once you've taken the pretest, viewed this preview lesson, which will give you some information about um, orientation in the course and this video in particular, you'll go on to the course lessons. So if you click here, course lessons, um, here are the four lessons that you'll be going through. When you click into view the lesson, you will see the steps that you need to take for that laid out in sequence. And it will mainly be watching a primary video in which you'll be looking at different things and asked to experiment and participate. And then below there's a link to additional resources in which you can explore other links and resources based on your needs. Then at the end, there's a simple assessment, uh, one question asking you to go to the forum to share your learning there. So in the forum, it'll look something like this. There's an introduction um, and then a forum for each of the lessons. There you'll be asked to um, interact with others and share some of the things that you have found. So even though this is an online course and people are going to be doing this at different times, you'll be able to see what others have uh, posted and maybe learn from them as well as share your own experiences. At the end of the course, I'll go back to course here to get back to the main page, you'll be asked to take a final assessment and then see how much you have expanded and um, in what ways you have grown throughout the course. So. I'll be here throughout the whole time to answer questions and guide you and support you along the way. And I hope you find this to be a valuable experience. So let's get going.